No one is free until all of us are free. Free Palestine. La actriz Susan Sarandon da un discurso memorable bajo la lluvia en Nueva York en defensa del pueblo palestino. Por su postura de no a la guerra ha perdido contratos, pero hay algo que no le podrán quitar jamás, sus principios. Thank you and welcome all you soggy people. Napoleon said, and this is Napoleon Bonaparte, not the Napoleon Dynamite. He said, war, war is when the government tells you who your enemy is. Revolution is when you figure it out for yourself. And we know who our enemy is. Our enemy is hate. Our enemy is racism. Our enemy is colonization. Our enemy is greed. And our enemy is silence. The silence of those who look away when you see crushed children, starving babies, wailing mothers, fathers dicking through the rubble to try to find their families. This is unacceptable. Now disrupting the narrative of the powerful, fighting for justice, can be lonely work. It can be exhausting, but nothing compared to what is happening in Gaza, in Rafah, for the Palestinian people that have been going through this for 75 years. Right. Speaking inconvenient truths can lose you your livelihood. It can lose you Friends, it may lose you family. But I want you to look out now at this sea of umbrellas and people here, because we are your family. You are not alone. As he said, there are hundreds more across Manhattan, hundreds of thousands across the United States, millions globally who are standing for Palestine for justice for a ceasefire. Millions of people who will keep showing up, who will keep organizing, who will keep speaking out, who will be loud. And we must embrace each other and thank each other and encourage other people to be brave and come out for what will ultimately be proven to be on the right side of history. No one is free until all of us are free. Free Palestine.